Oh look, I skipped the clutch again. <laughs> well, <clears throat> welcome everybody. Uh, yeah, this is the first video with my voice, so my English might not be that good. And honestly, who cares? So, as you already know, this is my yearly video about the predictions of every NASCAR season. So, uh, if you wonder what happened to last year, uh, I was lazy to do a, a predictions results video for last year, so I guess I'll just leave the results here. Uh, 16 correct, 26 incorrect. Yeah, I, I don't know if it, it was better than 2022 or might be worse. I don't know, I'm not sure. But hey, it's good to know that I got a lot of these correct. So, right off the bank, let's start the predictions. And as always, uh, 5 predictions for Arca, uh, 7 for Trucks. 10 for Trinity and 20 for Cup. This is gonna be a long ass video, but hey, we'll, we'll do this real quick, I guess. So let's start off. Okay, prediction number one for Arca William Sowolic will win at least six times. Prediction number two Andy Jankowiak will win a race. Prediction number 3 Andres Perez de Lara will win twice Prediction number 4 Gas Dean will return to victory lane in one of his starts Just please And prediction number 5 Chris Wright will win the ARCA Championship now into the truck series. Prediction number one. Corey Heim will win five times. Prediction number two. We will see another flip during a plate race. Prediction number three. Lane Ricks will finally win a truck race. I'm guessing at a short track. Uh, prediction number four. Kyle Lush will win in the truck series, but not in all of his five starts. Prediction number five. Stuart Friesen will make it to the playoffs again. Prediction number six. Nick Sanchez will win twice. And prediction number seven, which is my final four predictions. I'm guessing Corey Hine, Ty Majeski, Nick Sanchez, and Christian Eckes. Now into the Xfinity series, prediction number one. Sam Mayer will win five times. Prediction number two. Only one super speedway will be won by Austin Hill. The rest will be by many different drivers. Prediction number three, Chandler Smith will win three times. Prediction number four, Cole Coster and Riley Hurst will combine for a total of seven wins. That guy might be him. Prediction number, uh, damn it, five, uh, Eric Almirola will win once again. Prediction number 6 A rock course race will not be won by either AJ Allmendinger or SBG uh, Prediction number 7 Shane Van Giesbergen will win 4 races Yeah uh, Prediction number 8 Josh Williams will miss the playoffs Prediction number 9 Parker Kluderman will finish higher in points than Kelly Deegan And for the final prediction The final 4 I have Cole Custer Sam Mayer AJ Allmendinger And Chandler Smith 
And finally, for the Cup Series, 20 predictions there. Prediction number one, Chase Elliott will win four times. Prediction number two, Austin Cedric will win again. I guess I'm a road course. Prediction number three, Baba Wallace will win twice. Prediction number four, all Stuart Haas racing cars will miss the playoffs. Prediction number five, Cascarola will score a top 10 finish somewhere, I don't know. Uh, prediction number six, only one Spar Motorsports car will finish inside of the top 30 in points. That's up in prediction number seven, I think. Uh, both RFK racing drivers will win at least once. Prediction number eight. Christopher Bell will win five times. Prediction number nine. William Byron will win the Coca-Cola 600. Prediction number ten. Despite not making it to the playoffs, at least one Stuart House racing car will win during the playoffs. Uh, prediction number 11, Tyler Reddick will win five times, and he will make it to the final four. Prediction number 12, Shane Van Gisbergen will win again. Prediction number 13, Alex Bowman will win a race, and he will make it to the playoffs. Speaking of making it to the playoffs, prediction number 14, Eric Jones will be making the playoffs again. Prediction number 15, John Hunter Nemechek will finish higher in points than the past two 42 cars drivers in the standings. He'll, do it. He'll finish higher. Prediction number 16, Ty Gibbs will finally win a cup race. I'm guessing Bristol. Prediction number 17, unfortunately, Daniel Suarez will go winless again. He might be free agent for this. Prediction number 18, somebody will flip again in the Daytona 500. It's a trend once every two years, so yeah, get used to it. Prediction number 19. My final four is... Well, crazy. I have Danny Hamlin, Christopher Bell, William Byron, and Tyler Reddick. Yeah, only 100 cars. The rest are Toyotas. This will be one. And for the final prediction... Uh, well, it's the Daytona 500. Think. Uh, well, you know, this is very generic, but like, he's a really good plane racer, just can't catch a break. And, well, let's see if he finally does it. Revenge for last year, of course, revenge for 2019, revenge for any other race he was close. The former Candyman, Kyle Busch, will win the Daytona 500. I guess. Please, at least we just win the Daytona 500 and we're all good. So yeah, that's the predictions video. I hope you all enjoy it. Uh, this is a quick one. I I should have made the, the predictions video like before the clash, but I wasn't in town, so yeah, I'm doing this right now. So and yes, this is my boys reveal. Unless you watch my channel right around the. Uh, 2021, that the little bit of uh, the Daytona 500 reactions, that that was horrible, but like, unless you have watched that, here's my voice, and thanks for watching, everybody. I'll see you next time. Uh, have a good one, and take care.